Hi guys. Happy Saturday morning. I got some espresso roast, half and half maple syrup and brown sugar. So good. Anyways, I'm packing to go back to California. It's Saturday morning and I'm going back on Tuesday and I bought some new stuff. I don't really need to bring too much because I already have a bunch of stuff there at my apartment. Um, but yeah, so I'm bringing just a backpack, no suitcase or anything. But I got a new purse. I haven't bought a new purse in so long. So I got this one from Michael Kors. I'm so excited. I actually didn't want a pink one. I specifically, I've never really bought a pink bag because I feel like it just doesn't match enough stuff to have as like my main purse. But it's okay. I saw it and I needed it. How do I get this off? Somebody just knock on the door. What is this? What's happening right now? <laughs> okay, it's not me. Anyways, I don't care. They can leave. Ooh! I love it. I love it. I love this color. What did I get on it already? I got something black on it already, I fear. Anyways, that's fine. I got some clothing from the thrift store, and I also got a new backpack from Amazon. The only reason I ordered it from Amazon is because of Prime Day. I got to change my address. It's a pretty small backpack. I thought it was a little bit bigger, but it'll I'll make it work. It's also pink, which I think was kind of a bad idea because I'm gonna have both of them. And they're really like not the same pink at all. So, but like, you know, you won't even be able to tell because this one will be at the back and this one will be at the front. So it's fine. First, I got this from Plato's Closet. I wore it for an audition that I didn't book, but I really wanted to. Um, and I think this was actually part of the reason why I might not have booked it because this was all I had. Like it was like a last minute thing and I had just went to the thrift store and like this was like all I had to change into. And it just didn't fit the vibe. I can't tell you what the vibe is because it would, it's confidential, but anyways, I just put it on and did it. And it looked cute. I love this color. I love pink, if you haven't, if you haven't noticed. I'm gonna obviously pack my Revlon brush because I love this thing. Everyone says it makes their hair fall out. I don't know if my hair is falling out or not. Um, if it was, I wouldn't know if it was due to the constant bleaching anyway or this. But yeah, I mean, I don't use it when my hair is like really wet, which I've seen is part of the issue. So don't do that. I always like use it when my hair is almost dry at least with a good heat protectant. I'm gonna bring this straightener to leave in LA. Um, Sorry, the dishwasher is a little bit loud right now. This is the worst hair straightener ever. I wanted to show you guys this. Don't buy this. Don't ever buy this fucking hair straightener. It's terrible. It is terrible and it rips your hair out and it hardly works. Your hair has to be already like straight and smooth for this. Like it's it's more of like a little touch up. Like you can't actually straighten your hair from curly with this. This thing sucks. I hate this motherfucker. Yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna bring it and just leave it there. By the way, this is the person question that's starting to fall apart. It looks kind of fine when I hold it like from far away, but like if you look at it close up, everything's like rubbing off. So I'm excited to have a new one. This was more stuff I got from Plato's Closet. Actually, wait, I got these shoes from Superstore. What? What is happening right now? There's craft dinner noodles in, in it. What? I've never been more confused in my entire life. I have a little garbage here. Okay, take two. What? Out of all things, too. <laughs> I never even eat craft dinner, I swear to God. Anyway, I got these shoes from the Superstore when I was grocery shopping one day. Because they were on sale for $14.49. And I don't know. I just thought they were cute. They might fall apart fast because it's Joe Fresh. And I feel like Joe Fresh probably isn't that great quality. But they were really cheap. Originally $40. Which, 
they probably aren't worth $40. They're probably only worth the $15. So, yeah. Anyways, I was kind of hoping they were going to match. Uh, they kind of do. It's like it's like a, you know, they'll be far enough away type of deal where nobody will notice. But, yeah. So, that was weird. I got this from Plato's Closet. I think every single woman in the entire world looks good in a dress this style. I feel like nothing looks good on my body, and these do. And I just think, like, no matter what shape you are, these look good. It's, like, just tight in, like, the boob area and then flowy for the rest of the dress. So, I don't know how much this was. I already took the tag off, but it's the brand Monto Los Angeles. And I think it was only $10.00 in pretty good condition there's like no stains or anything so yeah i don't know like what the weather's gonna be like because right now in la it's like 30 degrees but every time i step into la it becomes cold like every single time it's like my canadian air follows me to los angeles what is that something really loud yeah. And it already is, like, starting to cool down on um, Tuesday. It says it's going to be, like, 29. And then, like, by Friday, it's, like, 23 degrees. Like, are you serious? Are you serious? You know what the crazy part is? There's no more craft dinner in this bag. It was just in the shoe. I got my new hair extensions, which I did a review on these. Um, I might just wear these to the airport, to be honest. I'm probably just gonna wear them to the airport. That's what I do every time. And it seems silly, but maybe it is. I don't know. I'm gonna bring my old curling iron. Who knows what brand this is? It's been burnt off. I got this for my mom when I was like 14 and it's still kicking. A lot of the like paint is coming off like on the inside. It's probably like Revlon or something. I don't know. But I freaking love this thing. Never fails me. Obviously, I'm going to pack my passport, but it's not here. It's at my dad's house. So I have to go get it. But I don't understand people who, like, get to the airport and forget their passport. Like, that's, like, the one thing you need. Like, everything else other than, like, your passport and your credit card. Like, you just need those things. Maybe a little bit of cash. Everything else you can just buy when you get there, wherever you're going. You can just buy it. And you forgot the one damn thing that you can't really replace. You're crazy. You're crazy. I got the most amazing skirt from the mall. Let me show it to you. You guys. First of all, I don't know what I got on it already. It's got stuff on it. <laughs> I literally just bought this. I haven't even gotten a chance to wear it. But look. There's shorts in it. There's shorts built into it. Why are there skirts? with no shorts built into it. Like after I found this, I put this on, I was like, this is the best thing I've ever worn. Because if it blows up, they're already there and they're already built in. Like it's so convenient. Why, why aren't more people doing this to their skirts? Like why? These are perfect, I love this. I'm gonna bring it for sure. Do you guys wear, when you guys wear skirts, do you guys wear like, like nylons, like skirts? like skin color nylons or like the clear ones or like black ones. I wear them every single time and I actually feel embarrassed when I don't wear them, but none of my friends wear them. And they think it's weird that I wear them and they're always like acting like they're for like older people. But like, why would I have my bare legs when I could have like nylons on, right? Like, does anyone else feel like that? Cause same. Okay, my backpack, I think it's good. Other than my makeup bag. <sighs> I need to save this because I sold um, one of my old coffee makers on Poshmark. I didn't know what the hell to do with it. I had two Nespresso machines. Didn't use either of them, so I sold one of them for like $20 <laughs> on Poshmark. I'm gonna save this for shipping it out today. I'm gonna bring this hair bow. I've always wanted to be a bow girly, so I bought this at Forever 21 because the skirt thing was like buy, th buy one thing, get another thing for a dollar. So I got this for a dollar. I think it's gonna look super cute. I tried to put it in though and I, I fear it didn't look cute. So anyway, I hope I can make it look cute later. Cause I love it. I love these really long ones. Looks like I'm getting married. 
that my purse. My nice clean purse. I'm so, I'm like already like pretty sad about this thing getting dirty because I just know, I just know that I'm not gonna be able to keep this clean. Love it while it lasts. My phone continuously runs out of storage and it doesn't make sense because I'll go and delete 500 videos or some shit and then it'll still be out of storage. And I'm like, how wasn't I out of storage 500 videos ago then? Like, how does that even add up? Anyway, I'm gonna go to Winners and get a new wallet or Arbeen, I don't know, whatever one is like cheaper. Um, so yeah, and then I have a sweat set that I'm gonna wear to the airport. I'm gonna try to do a travel vlog, but I get embarrassed out in public. And I'm taking the train from Union in Toronto. So I'm gonna be like in public like the entire time and I'm just leaving my car here. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try to do a travel vlog, but this is the set I got to wear to the airport because I think it's gonna be so cute with like my purse and like my sunglasses. Like I might wear my hair extensions like just cause I think it fits the like vibe, but anyway, we'll see, we'll see on Tuesday. So yeah, I think I have everything packed that I need other than my passport and I need to find my driver's license and I need to clean my car so bad so that I don't come home to something like crazy in my car because one time I came home to like a iced coffee that I left for a month. That was disgusting. So yeah. Oh, what is this? <gasps> this backpack has a phone charger? This, I probably need a power bank. So I'm just not gonna use that. Okay, I got all my stuff. I'm ready to go. I'll see you on Tuesday, hopefully.